All right, welcome back to Davis Drives. Got an F650 Super Cruiser 4x4 air ride suspension with Kelderman. Crew cab truck here today. This truck is the behemoth of trucks. I wish I had a way to show the size comparison. Other than I'm just shy of six foot and I'm considerably underneath the mirror. Left and right side storage boxes, dual oversized stainless tanks, super single, 385 tires. These have just been balanced and trued and the wheels have been fully professionally high polished. Haven't cleaned or washed it, so I want to catch this video. This man is very meticulous, but he just drove this in from Tennessee. And you can still see how clean it is. So, Kelderman air ride system. Front and rear airbags. All that works perfectly. Matter of fact, it's been sitting for a couple hours. It did not leak down at all. The air pressure was still up really good. Front heavy duty bumper with a winch. All that works properly. Sun visor over top the windshield. Tank on this side as well. Storage box on this side as well. Stainless mud flaps as well. Matching heavy duty rear bumper. Got an air chuck hook up in the back so you can run a trailer or air accessories. Aftermarket tail lights. If I remember correctly, that's a power bid cover. So one cool part about this truck is we actually sold it to a guy in New Mexico about two or three years ago, right, right in COVID. And uh, he just bought it as a toy. He had a big business and uh, he ended up selling it to this fella in Tennessee, which tracked us down. So we're happy to have it back again. Also, you'll notice the power folding amp research steps, which make it actually possible to get in because it's darn near impossible to get in any other way. WeatherTech floor mats. Push button Allison transmission. Big old diesel there. One of the other cool things about this truck is it's not riddled with check engine lights and trouble codes. The brake light there is because the parking brake is on. 69,000 miles. A couple extra gauges right here. So, went over all the details with this customer and everything is working as it should inside. Christian actually went step by step with him because he wanted to show him how everything worked. He's got this cool little console with a drink cooler. Some storage here, called a daddy cool. Refrigerator there. And again, if you got your cup sitting in here, it keeps them nice and cold because it's part of the refrigerator. The other nice thing is because this thing is a monster, it has a heck of a lot of blind spots. So if you signal left, there's your left blind spot. You signal right, there's your right blind spot. You got a uh, forward facing camera. And let's see about rear. And a rear facing camera. That's pretty slick. Christian said that worked, so I just didn't want to be a fool in the middle of this video and it not working. Uh, transfer case, all push button. Shows you what to do and what not to do. Another entertainment uh, setup right there that should be tied in through this. I think they're dual linked if I remember correctly, but he knows for sure. It's all Bluetooth with satellite radio. It does have a old school uh, Viper style alarm. I think it's an aviator. But really nice. That's been upgraded since we had it, but that's an extremely nice screen setup with all kinds of different apps built into it. You can hear the motor runs great. Again, no check engine lights, no trouble codes. It's got some nice kick out, build out speakers there. Focal, so somebody spent some money. WeatherTech floor mats. Speakers in the back there as well. A couple tweeters up top. And that makes a bed. So that's actually a fold-out bed. It's got some speakers underneath of it. 
I would leave that on, but it's gonna be noisy out here. Power steps on this thing are the real deal. And again, when this truck's cleaned up, it really shows well. Very clean white truck, very well accessorized, and he just drove it 65 to 75 miles an hour the whole way here to drop it off. With the tires balanced and true, the alignment right, everything's greased. He said track down the road perfect. I just drove it around the block up to our inspection station and it did, it hit the road perfect. Doesn't have all the normal shimmies and shakes. The bed's in great shape. A lot of these, the beds get really broken up. Um, obviously this is a Ford Dually bed that would also be on a 350 or 450, but on a 650, a lot of times they have cosmetic cracks in all these areas and up top just from all the beating and banging. But this one being on air ride, definitely rides and drives tremendously better. So not as harsh on the truck. Mud flaps are nice, they keep all the rocks down. And when we wash and clean this thing up, it's gonna be pretty impressive. Even got stainless in here. All this will clean up really good. You can see, just road ground from driving it. That's a jumper port right there. If you need to use jumper cables to start this or start something else. It should have a dump valve inside. So if you wanna dump the suspension down to easy hook up to a truck, it should have that in there. If it doesn't, that can be added. We just added it to one that was not factory equipped and it worked great. But there is your F650 Behemoth Super Cruiser. This truck was built by Super Trucks in Georgia. Uh, Chris's Super Trucks or Super Trucks by Chris. And uh, we've met Chris and dealt with him quite a bit. He builds some killer trucks. And this is uh, one of the flagship models. Full wheel drive, full air ride, all the accessories, all the stereo, all the LED lights, the bumpers, the side steps, the tanks, the storage boxes. It basically checks every box available for one of these vehicles. So if you're looking for the King Kong monster of trucks, this would be the one. The only thing that would trump this is a international CXT just because that was factory built. We happen to have one of those too. So no matter which way you want to go, we got you covered. Uh, let me show you the exhaust. <clears throat> Somebody did a really nice job on the dual exiting exhaust. Again, it needs to be wiped up, but stainless tips coming out each side. Really cool looking. And it also has adjustable shocks. Those are uh, Rancho 5000s or 7000s. The brakes have been checked. The service has been done. The truck is greased. It needs nothing at all. This truck can be shipped to you anywhere in the country or driven to you or fly in and drive it home. Davis Auto Sales, Richmond, Virginia. This truck's available as of right this minute. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check it out on the website for some good detailed pictures and a little bit more information.